Oh, <laughs> hey there. Didn't see you come in. Welcome to Fox 17 Laboratories, where we're always working to bring you the latest and greatest in local broadcast technology. And I don't know if you heard, but coming up here on April 8th, we'll be experiencing a solar eclipse. And if you want to see this cosmic ballet and see it safely, you will first need to pick up a pair of these eclipse viewing glasses. Now we've got a lot of resources on our website, fox17online.com, that tell you what to look for when picking up a quality pair of these so you can stay safe during the eclipse. But let's say you can't get your hands on a pair of those glasses. What do you do then? Luckily, there are several NASA approved alternatives and I'll show you how to make one here today, a pinhole camera. Luckily, you're not gonna need a lot to get this done. Just two pieces of cardstock, some aluminum foil, or a couple of pieces of aluminum foil just to be safe, tape, a pair of scissors, and a safety pin, pin, pencil, anything you have lying around that can make a small hole in this tin foil. So, here's how we start. Take one of the two pieces of cardstock, fold it in half. Safety first, of course, remember that. Fold it in half, make a nice crease, and then in the center, you're going to want to take your scissors and cut a rectangle, about one, two inches, doesn't need to be that big, as you'll see here, but something you can easily get out of that cardstock. Voila, just like that, nothing fancy. Then, step two, take a piece of your aluminum foil and tape it over that rectangle you just cut in the middle of your cardstock. Doesn't have to be pretty. You get extra points if it is. Should look something like this when you're done. Again, pretty straightforward, pretty simple. Then the final step, take your pen, your pencil, your uh, paper clip, whatever you have, and poke a hole in the center of that aluminum foil. And there you go, your very own pinhole camera. The next step, take this piece, the piece you haven't cut, and put it on the ground. Once on the ground, position yourself between this clean piece of card stock and have the Eclipse behind you. Use your new pinhole camera, foil side up above the piece of card stock. And since we are inside right now, it's been uh, raining quite a bit. I'm going to use some artificial sun, but the result should be the same. You see the light from the sun enters the pinhole, gets focused, and then projects the image out on the other side onto the piece of paper on the ground. Not a bad way to enjoy the eclipse safely if you can't find a pair of glasses. And remember, we do have a lot more information about the upcoming eclipse on our website, fox17online.com. Reporting from here in Grand Rapids, Andy Curtis, Fox 17 News.